output job files have been around for some time, and many Altium users love the fact that they can pre-configure and batch process uniform outputs for fabrication, assembly, and even a collaboration with other product development functions within the organization. In release 10, the output job file editor has had some major enhancements to make the process of releasing product data and creation of manufacturing instructions even more intuitive. For starters, assembly or fabrication variants and their scope can now be selected at the top, either for the whole batch output job, or you can choose to leave the variant choice to the PCB configuration manager for the managed release process, or variants can still be selected on an individual output basis. And in line with the new release management capabilities of Altium Designer, the different types of output are shown as output containers with publishable containers such as PDF documents, folder structures with files like ODB++ or Gerber's or HTML reports, and video animations of the board in 3D at the top, and hard copy printouts shown below. You can also select any output container and specify whether it is going to be release managed or locally created within your project's folder structure. Not only that, but each specific output container can be configured in more detail in advanced mode. For example, in this video container, I want the generated videos to be encoded with the FFD show codec and then saved as an SWF format movie, which I can then publish to a web page. You can also click here to generate the outputs locally or here to generate and publish them to a location defined in your publishing destination's preferences. The hard copy containers down here are separate because they don't get published to an online destination or a folder structure, but rather go straight to an output device such as a printer or plotter.